<coughs> the other reason that content tyranny exists is because we like our facts like we like our chicken. Think about this. When you go to the store and you go to the, uh, the meat section, you, you go, what do you expect of your chicken? You expect it to be in nice, nice little pink packets and, and with the, the sponge underneath and the cellophane and the, and the uh, foam underneath and, you know, the, the ship on date and the buy on date and everything's nice and clean. And every packet of little pink flesh is the same, equal size. And the most important thing of all is they should not resemble a chicken <laughs> in any way, shape, or form. At all costs, you should not see any of the necessary mess of the chicken. It should be clean. We like our facts this way. We like our facts to be true forever, and we like them clean. Because if they're not clean, we can't test on them with Scantron and bubble sheets. That's why we need them to be so clean. But the truth of the matter is, knowledge is not clean. It's changing all the time. It's messy business. Science is not, contrary to popular belief, clean. Science is messy construction business. It's like going to a construction site. Building knowledge is messy, messy business. And we, but we've turned it into these clean, tight little facts. And if it's not a clean, tight little, little fact, then we don't teach it. We like our facts like, the, like our chicken, but our, our facts really aren't like that. Our facts are very messy. 